I'm Stephanie Cashman, the Associate Objects Conservator here at the Milwaukee Art Museum. And over the last two years, the museum's conservation team has been working with outside experts to conserve Robert Gober's untitled installation and to recapture the artist's original intent. This started with a visit from Christian Schneiderman, an expert in Gober conservation. Under his direction, the pool was drained and thoroughly cleaned. Small repairs were made, and then a new marine grade epoxy was applied below the water level to protect the surface. Then he gave a thorough bath to these legs here, removing any growth that may have developed and also doing some small repairs. One of the biggest things he did was to recreate 300 pieces of seaweed that live in the water. The next step was to address the environment around the pool, colloquially referred to as the Gober Room by museum staff. Now this space gets hot and humid, which accelerates biological growth in the water. To prevent that, we replaced the really hot lights with cooler LEDs and added a new ventilation system to improve airflow. So the biggest difference of this installation is going to be its sound. Now there's a motor and fan continuously working to create the soft lapping of the water you see. The old motor did a fantastic job with creating these little waves, but was really loud, drowning out the sound of this water that the artist wanted you to hear. So working with engineer Franklin Berry, a new quieter motor was constructed. The final part of this project was for me to treat the suitcase and drain. This started with a thorough cleaning and dusting of the surfaces, followed by cleaning all of the metal parts and applying a protective wax coating. All of the little damages were repaired with a conservation grade adhesive, and then they were painted to match the surrounding original and to be less distracting. My favorite part of this experience was installing it in the gallery and seeing all of the pieces come together. We started this by removing the protective covering that was on the floor, putting down the grate and the suitcase here in the gallery levels. And then we went below and installed the legs and did all the little details and final adjustments. It's now on view for everyone to enjoy. Mm -hmm.